Hey everyone, welcome back to another Sims build challenge. So this comment suggested that we do every room as a different time limit. We have to do it. So our minimum is gonna be one minute and our max is gonna be seven minutes. Cause I feel like one minute is way too short, but seven minutes is a good amount of time for a single room. And no, I have not built the walls yet. So that's part of it too. For our entryway, we get 407 seconds. That's actually one of the longer amounts of time. So let me put that in my timer and let's go go. We don't even need for it to be that big. Like maybe we can do this. I don't even, you know what? We don't even need a second floor. I don't want to bother with a second floor. Is it cheating if I include a little front porch with this moment? Just because like we have the time, clearly. The hardest part about this is like trying to visualize the rest of the house while I'm doing this. I keep changing how I want this to look like 20 different times. Oh my goodness. Let's do a closet. I love to throw a closet in there to be honest. And maybe we can do like an archway and like the kitchen or living can be over there. I probably should prioritize floors and walls. I literally don't know how to design this house. I guess I'm gonna put windows there. That also would probably be a good place to put the main bedroom right off of the house so it's not like near everything else. Ooh, but the cluttering is definitely where this is gonna be a little more difficult, especially if we only get like 60 seconds for any of them. Obviously, we need some shoe racks. We need a shoe rack. We need a coat rack. We need umbrella. Oh my god, wait, I forgot about the front porch. That is not good. That is not good. Maybe we'll do a little chair. Where's the cats and dogs barrel plant? That's what I want. That's what would look so good out here. There she is. Let's do that. That actually looks really, really cute and welcoming to be quite honest. We need some sort of like painting. I don't know. 50 seconds. Okay. I think I am a liar when I said that almost seven minutes is like a really good amount of time to decorate and make a whole room. Like if we get this for the kitchen or for any of the bedrooms, we're over. It's over for us. I know this might make the closet not functional, but I like the cluttered look of it anyway. 35 seconds. What do we even do? I don't want to put curtains because like then will I have to put curtains in every single room after that? Do we have time to get an authority somewhere? Maybe in a cute little authority right there. Three, two, one. That's our entranceway and front porch area. To be honest, I'm pretty satisfied with that. I think that's really, really cute. And for the kitchen, we get 233 seconds. That's like four minutes. Ugh. Three, two, one. So maybe we should not do a very large kitchen. We need some lights. Obviously the goal of this whole video is just for the house to be functional. I need to not think about things too much because we probably need an entrance into the dining area and an entrance into there. Let's do two windows. Let's get our our flooring and ugh, you know in times of pressure I'm just gonna use the subway tile ooh, for the whole thing ew let's go with some parenthood counters haven't done that in a while a fridge let's put a sink right there and then I guess an oven you know what I'll take it other necessity we need a fire alarm we could do some cabinets I don't know how I feel about that and I just put it over the fire alarm so that's good oh it's definitely something I've done it before where I've just done like two opposite facing counters like that just so it's some extra space that's actually kind of really cute. Well, now there's no really good place for the bin. I'm like not impressed. I'm really trying to alt place the paper towel roll. 30 seconds. Can I get some utensils in here? Yes, I can. Okay, cool. Is that the kitchen? I don't like that that's the kitchen, but that's gonna have to be the kitchen. And so next, let's do the dining area and then the living area is gonna have to fit here somehow. And I'm imagining like a bedroom back here and a bedroom on the side maybe. Either way, we need a time for the dining room and that's gonna be 2.35. <laughs> good variety. Great variety there. Three, two, one. Okay, so at least hopefully these will be like similar in style or like quality because they are the exact same time limit, almost. Honestly, the hardest part about this challenge is having to figure out the layout of your house as part of the time limit. I think maybe if I were to do this again, I would pre-build the house with all the rooms and then I would get the time limit because this is difficult and I don't like it. This is gonna go into a big living area and then do we want like a little back porch? If we do, I'll add a little sliding glass last door. We don't even have the table yet. It's been like a minute and a half and I don't even have the table yet. Ew, wait, this is gonna look so bad because it's not gonna be centered with the archway. Massive apologies to everyone. At least that's kind of cute. We definitely want like darker vibes. We are getting like a painting or something in this room since we have nothing in the kitchen. Oh, should we do a rug? Not me literally going into the tool mod for this. That one looks really nice. Hang on. I like that. 50 seconds left. Maybe some eco lifestyle plants. Oh wait, that actually looks really nice. We can definitely get a plant. Jungle adventure tree. She's the first thing that popped up. Four seconds. Okay. Okay, this has to be our dining room. To be honest, this is not that bad. Okay, I'm scared because my plan for the living room is for it to be that big. It could be like that and then there could be a door to like two bedrooms. Anyway, for our living room, we get to use... I'm gonna re-roll. That's too similar to the other ones. For our living room, we get to use 303 seconds. I know I'm gonna regret asking for this, but when are we gonna get to the really low numbers? And go. We have five minutes. That is a really decent amount of time, I would say. First things first, let's make sure we have floors and walls. 
walls in here. I'm gonna go with that blue again. I like that. An abundance of lights because what? This is a Sarah Kendall build. Exactly. What in the world is the layout gonna be? Because we need some windows. I wanna do these floor to ceiling windows again. Maybe we should do like this. No, I hate that. Okay, maybe we do that. I literally do not know what I'm doing. Why does the couch look so weird? I really keep changing how the windows look and there's simply not time for that. What curtains was I using? These ones? I really should've put a drop shadow on the timer, shouldn't I have? We need something on this wall. Ew. Plant time, plant time. Absolutely. Guess what? We probably need another plant. 45 seconds. This has gone by so fast. I'm not enjoying it. I'm not enjoying it, everyone. Let's do a speaker. What kind of decor? 30 seconds. Sensational style stack. Then we're gonna get the nifty knitting baskets. That's gonna have to be our living area. It's really not the worst. It serves what it needs to do, but it's not good. <laughs> this is gonna be a bathroom. This is gonna be a bedroom. And then I think I wanna do another bedroom right here. For our bathroom, we are going to get 199 seconds. Okay. Now that's just over three minutes. So that should not be the worst. Three, two, one. Hello, my game is like frozen. That's not good. I mean, if this is gonna be the only bathroom in the house though, should it be at least a little longer? I think the shower tub combo. We don't even have a door. I have forgotten the door in time limit challenges before. Like not even just for a room. Like I've forgotten it for the whole house. I'm hoping this will be functional. Maybe I'll play test it before I put it on the gallery. I wish we had better like bathroom sinks to place in counters. Oh, parenthood mirror. Maybe it's her time to shine. You know the vibes. Oh my God, 56 seconds. Hang on. At least a hand towel like that. That towel rack is not my favorite. Soap and toothbrushes. And we're gonna move those. We're gonna all place those just a little bit. Okay, that's actually like a really cute bathroom. Bath mat, bath mat. 20 seconds, need a bath mat. I think that's it. There's no window. Not ideal to not have a window, but I'm like pretty satisfied. Okay, next we're gonna do bedroom number one. For bedroom number one, we're going to do 411. Okay, spill. I think I speak for all of us when I say I'm just waiting for the moment we get 420. <laughs> this is gonna be like the best bedroom we've ever seen and go. This is a huge bedroom. And you know what? That's because we're slaying. That's because this is what girl bossing is all about. I swear most of the time is gonna be dedicated to deciding if this room is too big or not. You know what could be fun for a change? Put the bed up on a platform. Now what bed do we use? I don't want anything too fancy like that. I love this bed. I think it's so simple and so nice. Thing is, I kind of love when the side tables snap to the lower level of the platform, but usually only one of them does. Not me using the tool mod again. I'm really glad this is not the no mistakes challenge. Could you imagine if we did like a no mistakes challenge, but it was also this challenge? Now we need a desk. I want to do a dresser as well. Three minutes. Okay, why is this getting stressful now? I really was feeling so confident. Also, we can move the door because that's not where I want the door to be. I don't like that mirror, but that's the one I grabbed and we don't have time to think about it. Get a little hanging plant in the corner there. Another hanging plant and another plant. Can I go again with this freaking candle? 128. I think we're actually doing okay. I don't necessarily love the blue, but you know that's what I've chosen. 35 seconds. Oh, we need curtains. Oh, we need curtains. And I can't put any curtains on there because that just would not make sense. Uh, I mean, it's nice. It's not my favorite. I think given another chance, I would maybe do a seating area, a couch or something right there. Also, I'm realizing like, why did I put windows there if I'm just gonna put a bedroom right here? And for the second bedroom, 409. Wait, wasn't the other one 411? Okay, we'll do 277. I'm asking, I'm begging, give me like 100, 167. I asked for this. I know I asked for this, like two and a half minutes. Okay, let's go. Let's not make it as big. I know this area is so weird. I don't know why I've laid out the house like this, but like, as you can tell, this is the fault of the challenge is that I could not properly plan out the house. We're gonna do bunk beds, cause why not? right? Well, maybe we can use the jungle adventure mirror since I'm thinking of it. A pink dresser. Okay, vibes. Go off. We're actually like doing pretty okay. I think it's because I previously have done a bedroom, so now I'm thinking like I know everything that's supposed to go in a bedroom. We need a rug. Oh no, wait. Let's do like a cute little wall decal. Can I find a nightlight in this time? Yes, I can. Boom. Okay, to be honest, this is not the worst. It is the bare minimum. I love the color scheme. I think it's so cute. So now we need to do the backyard area and then we have to do the exterior and the roofing. So for the backyard, yard area, we're doing 263. Let's do it. We want pool vibes. This is way too big for my own good. Oh, you know what? We can do a little, mm, do I want a picnic table? I need to not overthink it. And that's what I'm doing. Let's do a light. I would like to at least have a grill. Okay. We have two and a half minutes. I doubt I will be able to actually get some plants in here. We could do some plant pots. We need an outdoor bin. Let's just like throw that on the side, I guess. Um, Let's do some plants on the outside up there. You know what? I guess this is what we have to do. Do we just extendo the pool a little bit? 13 seconds. Okay. I flew too close to the sun. Like I will admit it. I flew too close to the sun. I mean, that looks cute. It's not ideal though. I think the rug really brings it all together. This should be on the other side, but you 
you know what, I'm not gonna change that. Now it's time to, you know, paint the exterior, do some landscaping and roof it. I'm gonna lump them all together because I feel like that would just be the big finish this video needs. For the exterior, we're getting two minutes. There we go, there we go. I regret everything. <laughs> Three, two, one, let's go. I'm turning this to evening because that's where the lighting is gonna be best. You know what? I should start with the roofing so that it doesn't look the worst, but I'm actually going to do the siding because then at least we'll have the siding. Maybe let's start like this. I feel like that does look really bad. Honestly, from the back, looks kind of cute though. 40 seconds left. Okay, uh-huh. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, and now we just need a column. Oh, and we need landscaping. Oh no, wait, we need landscaping. Okay, wait, where's a tree? Oh, that's a big tree. Um, there's a smaller tree and we need like a little plant. Stop sizing down when I need you to size up. Do we have 10 seconds for terrain paint? Excuse me, sir. Do you have 10 seconds for our Lord and Savior terrain paint? No. Yes, I did it. This like objectively is the worst roofing that I've ever done. And it's because the layout is so bad. It looks so unfinished. But to be honest, like the front view like this is very, very cute. Back view like this, also very cute. But it also is so ugly. Obviously this will be on the gallery. You wanna download it? Reno it. Reno it and show me how it looks in our Discord, please. Anyway, I think that's all I have for you today. If you did enjoy this video, please give me a like. That really helps me out. If you enjoy Sims Build Challenges, make sure you subscribe. You can do so right up here along with my Streamery Uploads channel. If you wanna watch another one of my videos, you can do so right down here. Obviously, you can also follow me on Twitch and TikTok. Please comment down below more challenges you'd like to see. And other than that, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and a lovely tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye!